Hey up and welcome back to my little test marathon. I am halfway and everything so far has been pretty bloody good. Um, so yeah, this is number 16. Where, where are we? Number 16 and we've got 283 and a half ampere hours out of it. Mega. Um, pretty much exactly what it said on the sticker. Which is all jolly good. Everything's been pretty, pretty damn good. Really quite happy. Uh, quite unremarkable and nothing much to report on. There's not been any bloaters or anything like that. And the internal resistance is all very, very well matched at um, 18 milli ohms. I've been checking them before they go on the charger and when they come off of the, sorry, before they go on the tester and when they come off of the tester. And at different volts. <clears throat> Excuse me, and at different voltages, the internal resistance is is exactly the same. One cool thing I have finally figured out with the EB tester software is if you right click on your mouse, you can bring up the, the information for where you are on the curve. If you can see it. which is quite cool so you can interrogate it quite in depth it started at 3.6 you can kind of see how many amps you've used over the course of the discharge and at what voltage and at what point in the graph because you want to stay in the Goldilocks zone and stay out of the deep cliff where it just drops off like so that's where sort of all of the wear and tear and the stress on the cell appears. So say for argument's sake, where are we? 3.1 volts, got 267.3 ampere hours. And then it starts to drop off. 3 volts, 273 and off the face of a cliff so 2.9 volts um, 278 ampere hours and then it really really drops off what I might do is I might run this one again but where, where I have done this as a cycle you know I've got a charge weight discharge charge back up again it's all quite compressed and you can't I can't get a clear image so what I might do is I might run this through a single test so that I can just get one nice one nice graph but full screen and, and really see what's what and see what I can interrogate so what I might do is I shall discharge this back down to 2.5 volts and then give it a full charge and see how that lies <clears throat> so it's 40 amps test value I'm over here now I'm over here now so I've got mode mode discharge constant current sorry single test mode discharge constant current uh, test value 40 amps cut off voltage 2.5 volts and there's no max time or anything like that um, so I'll keep an eye on it throughout the day and I might have to set some alarms to get up at god knows what time in the morning and start it off again especially when I do the discharge test because I don't want to leave it overnight completely depleted might not be a good idea so give that a poke and see what happens Whee so that'll be that discharging down and we'll see how it goes. Brilliant investment, well worth it. But 
that when I first bought that I wanted to confirm the readings for that cheap AliExpress one and that matches that really good <laughs> right that's that done the first part of the discharge test nice pretty nice pretty curve there so if I right click and go to Okay, there's us at three volts, fifty nine point two nine amp hours. So easy maths, which we all like. Two point five volts, sixty nine point zero seven. So in that bit from there. At three volts to completely flat. There's 10 ampere hours hiding. Uh, so if we go down to 2.8, that's 65.83 to 69. So that's three and a little bit, and then it really starts to steepen up, steepen and drop off. which is quite kind of cool so we're going to stay on single test <coughs> and right, we are going to stay on single test and we're going to go down to the mode we're going to charge constant voltage test value will be 40 amps Oops, me well done uh, voltage will be 3.65 Zero one and which is the lowest it can go. Factory specs was actually cut off at 0 0.005 of an amp, but that's mental, that's far too low. So, double check charge constant voltage 40 amps, and the voltage 3.65. I'm going to cut off at 0.1 of an amp. No, nope. what have I done? What have I done? What have I done? There we go. <laughs> and off she goes. See so what? Pretty pattern this one draws. See you in about seven hours. <laughs> <laughs>